Hey, I'm Brian Westover with PC Mag. We are here looking at the ASUS ROG NUC. That's right. Intel's NUC line was taken over by ASUS. It is back from the dead. And now, Intel's enthusiast NUC line is back as the ASUS ROG NUC line, Republic of Gamers. What that means, you've got gaming hardware in the NUC form factor. Now, obviously, it's a desktop, but these aren't desktop parts. We're talking about high-end gaming, gaming-grade parts, like you would find in a gaming laptop. Meteor Lake processors, uh, so Core Ultra 7, Core Ultra 9, mobile NVIDIA graphics. This goes up to an NVIDIA RTX 4070, and unlike a laptop, you don't have to worry about things like battery life or skin temperature. You can run this as fast as it'll go. On top of that, you've got a full selection of ports, you've got a form factor that can easily slip into a backpack or a bag, take it to a LAN party if you and your buddies still do that. It's small, it's portable, it's compact, it's everything you wanted from the NUC, now with gaming and the ROG branding. This guy's coming in probably late March, or so early part of the year, but a few months out yet. Um, pricing, we don't have specific numbers. It's probably gonna start around $1,600 and go up from there. You can spec this up pretty high. Think again in terms of gaming laptops. Uh, this is gonna be similar in terms of price. But unlike a laptop, you're not gonna be stuck with a single display. You can hook this up to as big a monitor as you want or multiple monitors. It will drive multiple monitors. And the form factor, you can set this up with whatever you want in terms of keyboard, mouse, etc. If laptop gaming delivers the sort of performance you want, uh, you can now get that in this form factor, which is really cool. We're looking forward to seeing it, testing it, seeing exactly what it can do in a few months. But for now, we're PC Mag. We're here at CES in Las Vegas. Stick with us for the rest of the week.